What's up, guys? And welcome back to another episode. When y'all are seeing this, deer season has actually started, as most of you know. Um, that is bow season here in Texas, by the way, which I went hunting today. Um, did not see a thing this morning. Ah. Hey, go on. But um, I did see three little bucks this evening, and I did have a very good sit. Um, but this video is going to be some dove hunting, so I hope that you guys enjoy it. This is probably my last dove hunt of the season, but this was for a solo dove hunt. This was my my best hunt of the year for sure. Um, I went and did a bunch of dove hunting in a couple of different places. Uh, Creedmoor, South of Austin, is one of those places that I went and did some dove hunting with, uh, dove hunting at with Jackson which is a new friend that I met through YouTube. He watches the videos. Thanks, buddy. Um, him and I got to be pretty good friends, so I did some dove hunting with him, and we have really um, enjoyed it. But this, these style of hunts where you're just walking around out in the field is totally new and totally different to me. And Because everybody's used to just popping up some mojos and, and sitting underneath some trees and just kind of hanging out and waiting for the birds to fly over you. I actually really enjoyed this style of dove hunting more than just sitting because you know you get to get up and move around and go bump birds and you never know which direction they're going to come from you never know which direction they're going to fly up from so it made it way more challenging but um, it was a ton of fun i hope you guys enjoy this episode um, again like i said this is probably my last one of the season the video after this is going to be some deer hunting which which i know you guys are very excited for uh, again uh, t today was day one and I did not have any luck with putting a deer on the ground, but I still want to share um, the the morning and the entire hunt with you guys. But I'm gonna try to keep this um, this deer hunting and this season as exciting and entertaining as possible. Um, you guys know that I'm gonna be traveling north, south, east, and west. Um, actually, I did that backwards, but it's right for you guys. North, south east and west would be correct for me <laughs> whatever um i'm going to be traveling all over the state of texas and doing deer hunting i'm um, hunting exotics hunting hogs um, you guys know the whole shebang and i'm actually trying to work out some details for, uh, for next month for a mule deer hunt in nebraska i'm not sure if i'll be able to make that happen um it is really 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 short notice but i'm going to do my best but anyway guys enjoy this episode and let me know what you think in the comment section down below. I, um, my shooting was much better than it has been in the past, so leave me a big thumbs up for that. Be sure to hit that subscribe button if you have not already. And if you have, hit the notifications bell right there next to it so you get a notification every single time that I upload. Enjoy this video. Hey, um, if you take off, if one of y'all take off walking that way, the, there's a pasture, you'll see a fence running this way. We can hunt that. And then there's another one that's adjacent. You can hunt that one, and nothing like this fence running down this way, we can't hunt that side. So, But we've got that field and down this way is a long ways too. Okay. Fetch up, fetch up, go get it. Fetch up, go get it. Go get it. Touch it up. Good boy. Touch it up. Find it. Find it. Find it, buddy. Find it. There's a bird right there. Real dumb sucker. Got him, too. Good boy. Hold it. Hold it. Good boy. Good boy. Bird number two, guys. I've got one down right in here. Fetch it up, buddy. Find it. Find it. Good boy. Good boy. Drop it. Fetch it up. Good boy. Good 
Guys, my shooting's a whole lot more on point today. <laughs> I'm just leading too far, I think is what I'm doing. Touch him up, buddy. Drop it. Good boy. Good boy. Bird number four. I'm really plugging away at him a whole lot better today than I, I have been. Good boy. There's Dove right there. Fetch him up, fetch him up, fetch him up. Good boy. Well guys, I may actually get kind of close to a limit today. I'm actually shooting halfway decent. <laughs> Fetch it up, buddy. Hold it. Hold it. Drop it. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. We've got five birds down for the afternoon. So far, they're flying pretty good. I'm bumping them up. We're gonna try to get some more. Good working, buddy. Good working. Good working. Oh, we're right here. Remy, Remy. Oh, I thought I was going to double. Fetch it up. I was hoping I was going to double up on him, and I got more birds right over there. They just landed. Get out of there, Shell. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Hold it, hold it. Drop it. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Bird number six. Guys, I know y'all saw him in the beginning of the video, but one of my coworkers, Keith, and another buddy of mine that I go to church with um, are hunting down there, and we're kind of pushing birds, bouncing birds back and forth off of each other. Um, and I just saw where several landed right over here. So I'm going to take him, and we're going to walk back around the corner right down here and see if we can't get a couple more birds out of this group. I thought I was going to be able to double up on that flock that flew over, but <laughs> the way they were flying after my first shot, they just kind of started swooping and curving and turning so it was real hard to get that second shot in but let's go get these right here oh too far no bird no bird no bird no bird i was walking in the wrong direction i thought they were closer to this corner over here Oh well, I'm liking this little corner spot down here with the way it looks. Maybe I can bust up a few more birds out of here real quick. Oh, Caleb shot that bird. How many you got? Zero. Zero? I just saw you shoot one down over there. I you didn't find it? He's way too far out there. Not ah, no bird. I don't know why that one didn't bust up whenever I walked through there. Yeah. Usually they bust way early. Yeah, Oh man. I, I bumped him. I saw him. I was gonna shoot him, but then I didn't know where y'all were at down here. I saw you hit him twice, it looked like. There goes another bird over that corner I was sitting in. Yeah, there I saw some birds land right out there in the middle. Um, I'm going to walk this. I just got done walking this, so there may not be any this way. But Caleb, I know there's been... See where it's clear cut right through there down the fence line? There's always generally birds landing right in there. Fetch him up, fetch him up. Drop it, good boy, good boy. So guys, I hope that y'all enjoyed that little bit. It was a, a really good dove hunt for me. Kind of one of those good ones to end the season out. I ended up with seven birds. Uh, I took Caleb out with me and uh, my other co-worker and a co-worker of mine, Keith. And if you guys remember a bow fishing video a while back in the summer, I took Caleb out with me. I like getting him out and um, 
doing some uh, doing some stuff with me, doing some hunting, doing some fishing, magnet fishing, bow fishing, that sort of deal. It's good to take the, the younger guys out. Um, I, don't, I remember being his age and wishing that I had somebody to, to take me out, and then I kind of got to the point to where um, I got my driver's license and I started accumulating my own properties, and I've just been a hunting fool ever since. What can I say? <laughs> but uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate all the support. Um, I mentioned um, in this next video, but I'm going to mention it mention it in this one too um guys if we hit 50,000 subscribers by the end of this year so december 31st 50,000 five zero 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 i think that was right <laughs> somebody check me on that um here's what i'm going to do so this is going to be the biggest giveaway that i've ever done it's going to be super super cool um, i think a lot of you guys will like it but uh, here it is so if we hit 50,000 by the end of the year i will buy a matthews triax with the bow and the rest and a quiver and I will give it away at 50,000 subscribers I will give it away to one of you guys so be sure to hit that share button be sure to share to, to Facebook to uh, Instagram Twitter whatever I have all those social medias um, guys uh, share it and tag me and let's hit 50,000 by the end of this year if we can do that I will give away a triax I'm um, also at 20,000 I would like to try to give away a hunt with me uh, I want to take you guys out to do some hunting somewhere do something fun like that maybe bow fishing um, I want to give away a trip so one of you guys can uh, come down and do that with me um, it'll be it'll be super cool it'll be a ton of fun and I think that you guys would really really enjoy it um, if if y'all would please do me a favor and hit that subscribe button it, it really means a lot this channel has been growing um, pretty quickly here in the last few months and I, so I'm, I'm super grateful for all you guys that have uh, gone ahead and hit that subscribe button but I'm gonna end, I'm gonna close this one out the dove hunts um, are super special to me and I really enjoy doing them and it kind it kind of stinks that this is probably my last one of the season but hey we're rolling into into deer hunting and and whitetail hogs exotics you know the whole thing so it's going to be a ton of bow hunting i've got um a big series coming up in december it's going to be a seven day long whitetail hunt in two different counties um, i'm going to be traveling um, a big distance in between those two which will be really cool so you guys want to stay tuned for that um but yeah like i was talking about the, the dove hunting how it kind of stinks that it's over um it means that him and i don't really get to hunt together much anymore uh, I'm thinking about trying them out on some ducks this year, but dove hunting is what got me into hunting. Um, that's I started dove hunting when I was probably six or seven years old, and I I just I love it. It's it's a ton of fun, and it, it's kind of got a special place in my heart because that's what started um, my my love for hunting. And so I, it's um it's a ton of fun. It really is. You don't have to worry about scent control. You don't have to worry about the wind. You just get out there with a shotgun and sling some lead. Ooh. <laughs> But um, thank you guys so much for watching. I love each and every one of you. Y'all are amazing, and I'll catch y'all on the next one.